What's going on people and welcome back to my YouTube channel and if this is your first time seeing one of my videos my name is Coco and on this channel I mostly speak about perfumes so if that's something that you're interested in you can go ahead click that subscribe button or join the family thank you very much in today's video as you can already see from the title I'll be giving you my thoughts and review on the new release by Ocha in collaboration with Paul Reacts, That Girl Viral Vanilla, yeah. So if you'd like to hear my thoughts on this fragrance, please continue to watch. Welcome back my pebbles, I do hope that everyone is doing well. So viral vanilla this was launched this year may 31st to be exact and it's known as a amber vanilla fragrance for men and women quick talk about the packaging nothing really to it it just came in this box right here there's this tab here pull on this tab box open up that's where the fragrance would lie my thing is i just love that it's magnetic just listen love that <laughs> So a little info about Ocha, their headquarters is in Canada, but they're based out of New York. Don't ask, okay? Do you know what? Hold on. Look at this, please. Look at this, okay? Ocha gifted this to me about, I want to say about a year now. I know, shush. I haven't spoken about the fragrances. It's me, shush. But look at the packaging. Do you know what? I love when PR packaging just like, yeah. Listen, if you see me rocking this this summer, just shut up okay it's mine okay mine yeah i was gifted this but with no obligation to both guys let me just open this so you can actually see yeah so you open here guys guys like and the fragrances sit there as you can see one's missing this is their take on delina and as i told you guys yeah you guys know i'm not a massive fan of delina but Oaks delina i like it and you know what it's done it's done yeah yeah so the top one has three that one has two and the bottom one has two so these are all like inspiration fragrances i don't think you guys want a video on this but love the packaging back to viral vanilla guys the atomizer on hair pressurized oh my god look one more time cut the cameras cut the cameras now let's get into what this actually smells like because you didn't come here for my antics, yeah? You didn't come here for that. You came here to find out what this smells like, guys. The opening for this fragrance is really yummy. There's creamy coconut milk and there's sweet buttery caramel. Hear me out. You know how I like to put things in imagery, yeah? Walk with me. You see the coconut that's in here? Have you ever opened a can of coconut milk without actually shaking it? And like when you open it, you have that thick, silky slab of coconut cream on top. That's what you get in here. And for the caramel in here, listen, my nan always had caramel sweets in her bag, yeah? May her soul rest in peace. But she always had three different kinds of sweets in her bag. So number one would be the red and white mint sweets, yes. Black cherry and caramel sweets. But I'm talking the caramel sweets that's in the little gold wrapper. Yes, that one. And obviously it's Jamaica, it's hot, yeah? So when she's giving me the sweets sometimes, it has like, you know, it's been melted. That's the caramel in here. It's like buttery smooth melted caramel with silky coconut milk poured in. Yeah, that's the opening for this fragrance. And you see those two notes combined. They're providing this long lasting rich and sweet foundation to this fragrance. As we move into the middle of this fragrance, there's tonka beans and there's honey. The tonka beans is exuding warmth and you know, it's adding this comforting feel to the fragrance and the honey is syrupy. Yeah, and it's blending harmoniously with the other notes. As we move into the dry down and this fragrance begins to settle on my skin, there's marshmallow, there's amber, there's vanilla and there's white musk. You see the white musk and the vanilla, they go hand in hand. The vanilla is offering sweetness and the musk is offering powderiness. So combined, you're getting a powdery vanilla. To go along with the powdery aspect of this fragrance, we have some golden resinous amber that's adding depth. And then you see the marshmallow, it's trying to mellow things out by adding this light and fluffy feel. Listen to me, you see this fragrance here? It's good. Me, me love this. It's rich, it's decadent, it's in your face. Listen, it's enough to choke someone out, so be careful, yeah? Because this will choke someone out, but this, my love this. Hear me out here, yeah? on hair, Paul says that viral vanilla is a blend between vanilla sex, vanilla 44 and Bianco Latte. 
I have a sample of Bianco Latte here that I got from Abby. Shout out to Abby one time. But there's a coumarin note in Bianco Latte that doesn't work well with my skin. And I am so happy that that note is not in Viral Vanilla. I also think that this is a tad bit more dense than Bianco Latte. And how does this compare to Eclair by Latafa? I don't know because I haven't got my nose on it yet. But I'm 100% sure that this and Eclair by Latafa smells the bloody same. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Hi guys, Editing Coco here. I... shy. <laughs> I know I said in the video that I don't know what Latafa's Eclair smells like, but as I'm editing, it just got delivered. So if you guys want a review on this or even a comparison between this and Viral Vanilla, let me know. Do you want to open the box and show them? There we go, guys. Eclair's there, so let me know. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. As for price comparison, Bianco Latte is 100 mil and that goes for 125 pounds. Viral Vanilla is a 50 mil and that goes for 45 pounds. And Eclair by La Taffa is 100 mil and the cheapest I've seen that for is 50 pounds. Again, as I always say, it's your money. Spend it how you see fit. But if I was supposed to say what this smells like to me, you heard that right? to me yeah me this is a toss-up between or a mixture between bianco latte and escapade gourmand yeah this right in the middle of those two fragrances yeah this has strong sillage and beast mode projection you see for longevity 10 plus hours on my skin do not play with me hear me out yeah if you're a vanilla girly you're gonna love and appreciate this but if you're not you're gonna be like nah this is too overpowering and doing too much but take my advice and spray lightly okay i did say this is enough to choke someone out yeah yeah listen i can't wait until like the brick of winter to wear this because oh my god mm, i know this is gonna stand up and cut through the cold now let's get into some layering combinations come on it's me it wouldn't be me if there was no layering involved, okay? Okay. Before I get into the layering combinations, quick shower routine, yeah? I shower with this. This is the Dove Caring Bath with Shea Butter and Warm Vanilla. Then to moisturize my body as I come out of the shower, I use these two. This is the Vaseline Cocoa Radiant Body Oil and this is the Nala's Baby, listen, okay? You see the entire Nala's Baby Body Care? Listen, I don't have a baby, nor do I want one, but the entire body care slaps. The vanilla cloud slaps. This is the vanilla cloud at nighttime oil. Please, nighttime wear. I use this on my skin and listen, this smells divine. When I mentioned Nala's baby body care, you thought I was joking, yeah? Body butter, body lotion, and body oil do not play with me. When I say this smells divine, it smells divine. Vanilla cloud, okay? I'm out here smelling like a vanilla cloud. Then to cream my body, I use this. This is the creme brulee by Laura Mercier. This is the truth. You guys know me already. I love this. When I wear this, people legit want to take a bite out of me, yeah? Laura, babe, Laura, yeah? I'm going to need you to take this out of retirement because <laughs> I don't know why you discontinue this, but I'm begging you, bring this back. I won't lie to you. I didn't like spending £45 for a body cream, but luxury, I love this. Bring it back, Laura. Then I would put like a few spritz of this, not a lot, a few spritz of warm vanilla sugar by Bath and Body Works, and then this on top. Oh my god, come and see dessert. Yeah, come and see snack. Yeah, snack. Listen to me, yeah. I'm out here walking around smelling like a stupendous confectionery. Yeah, put some respect on my name. I smell good. I'm sorry, I got carried away. Let's get into the layering combinations, okay? Let's get into it. First up, we have Viral Vanilla with Nebras. You know it was coming. I'm sorry, you knew it was coming. Guys, a luxurious blend that combines the richness of vanilla, caramel, coconut milk with velvety chocolate. Sign me up. Come and see desserts. I put Viral Vanilla down first, Nebras on top. Next up, we have Viral Vanilla layered with French coffee. Hear me out. I got this from Jade. Jade, subscriber turned friend. Listen, I love when my subscribers, subscriber, she's not my friend, yeah? I love when they send me stuff. Okay, I'm forever grateful. If you want to send me nothing, send it. I ain't going to stop you. Send me something. But I know a lot of you are looking at this like, isn't this Choco No, this is Choco Moss. This, French coffee. Do you know what? As I just took up Choco Moss, that can actually layer with Viral Vanilla as well. Add it to the list. Back to these two, listen, this French coffee literally smells like what it says, French coffee. You know those instant coffee that you pour the boiling water and the coffee smell is just so strong? This is it. 
And you see, after the strong coffee smell dissipates, you get this creamy vanilla. Listen, with this added on top, you have the most beautiful French caramel vanilla latte. D don't play with me. This down first, this on top. Next up, we have viral vanilla and blanche bet. Don't judge me, I only have a sample. Don't judge me. But these two together, milky white floral notes, along with some coconut caramel goodness, do not piss me off. These two together, sensational. I, I need a bottle of Blanche Bet. I'm not gonna lie to you. Next up, we have Vial Vanilla layered with Ansem Gold. Oh my God, guys, they share a marshmallow note, okay? They share a marshmallow note. The essence of fluffy marshmallow combined with caramel, coconut milk, and vanilla do not piss me off. This down first, this on top. Next up, we have Viral Vanilla layered with Rose Gourmand. These two powerhouses. Rose Gourmand by Zara on its own. Powerhouse. These two, <laughs> nuclear. You do not need more than three sprays each, okay? Fruity vanillic rose with sweet yumminess of caramel and milk. <laughs> Hello? Yes. Rose Gourmand down first, this on top. Next up, we have Viral Vanilla layered with Shag of Utonka, irresistible sweetness of almond marzipan bathed in creamy sugary milk. I'm sorry, does that not sound yummy to you? That sounds very yummy. I put this down first, this on top. Next up, we have Viral Vanilla layered with Francie. This is said to be a dupe for Gris Chanel by BDK. Hear me out. Imagine wrapping yourself in the cozy embrace of a freshly brewed chai latte with two pumps of caramel syrup. I'm so I'm sorry, yeah. Viral down first, this on top. Next up we have Viral Vanilla layered with Vanilla Woods by Seven Virtues. The comforting notes of vanilla, along with the subtle richness of the woods, all combined in a creamy, milky sweetness. Uh, yes, this down first, this on top. Next up I have Viral Vanilla with these two, yeah? We have Camera and we have Sheriff Blend. I mean, look, I have barely anything left in my camera. But hear me out, yeah? These are two boozy fragrance, but two completely different dry down. With Sharf Blend, I get this freshly baked cinnamon bun drizzled with creamy condensed milk. And with Camera, I get this Irish coffee feel, but with rum instead of whiskey. And then a touch of honey to enhance the sweetness. <laughs> Listen, yes. I got this layering combination from Jane. Jane, again, big up yourself, yeah? Listen, for both of them, Sharf Blend and Camera, this down first, and then these two on top. And for number 10, because I've been counting in my head, yeah? I've been counting. We have Viral Vanilla and a sweet pastry in Paris. Oh my God. Hear me out. Imagine a lemon pound cake with the rich creaminess of condensed milk creating a very delectable treat. Oh my God. You see this, yeah? This crawled so that Devotion and Baked by Acro could walk. Yeah. This crawled so they could walk. Yeah. Put some respect on this. Hear me out here, I had 10 written down, but I can give you two right now off the top of my noggin. Viral Vanilla layered with La Belle by Jean-Paul Gaultier. I say this all the time, this just smells like a dessert that you've been yearning for after being on a diet for a day. These two together, yummy. Then we have Viral Vanilla and Sea Intense by Giorgio Armani. Are you crazy? You see the black currant syrup in here, the vanilla, the rose, when everything come back. Do you know what? Let me shut up now. I'm... That's 12. I can keep going. I can keep going. That's 12. I'll let you guys have 12, yeah? Have 12. This fragrance hair, it evokes a feeling of comfort and indulgence. This is an amazing gourmand fragrance. A remarkable gourmand fragrance. Hear me out. I know that it's duping something, but listen, I'm in a business board that because this is so good. This is viral vanilla. Well, there you have it, my darlings. My thoughts and review on this fragrance here. That girl, Viral Vanilla. Yeah, listen, how much layering combos did I give you? 10, 11, 12 layering combinations. Yeah. Hello? Oh yeah, I must mention that this was indeed sent out to me in PR. I know a lot of people don't like disclosing stuff like that, but it was sent out to me in PR but with no obligation to post, yeah? And I think I have a 10% code for first time users. Listen, if you wanna use it, you use it. You don't wanna use it, don't use it. I think it benefits you more than it does me. But hear me out, even though it was sent to me in PR, I absolutely love this fragrance. So hello, of course I'm gonna talk about it. 
Well, that's me done, my darlings. I am gonna end the video here because I feel like I've been, you know, I've been rambling on about this fragrance for a bit too long. So I'm gonna shut up now, yeah? Thank you so much for joining me in today's video. Listen, your time that you spent with me, it's greatly appreciated, guys. Thank you. But I'm gonna ask you before you go, don't forget to give me a thumbs up by clicking that like button. Comment down below and let me know your thoughts on this video. If you smell this fragrance, let me know your thoughts as well, yeah? Let me know your thoughts as well on Bianco Latte, Eclair, or any other dupe that you have smelt. Share this video with a mate. Don't forget to subscribe before you go. And I guess I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Mask this, amber this. Vanilla and marshmallow. Sweetness and the musk, musk, musk. Guys, I'm stuffy. As I said, I can't say as I said because it's the first time I'm saying it. <laughs> My nose are on. Guys, editing Coco hair. I know I said. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to open the box? Don't put. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean it. You wanna be. Put up, put up. <laughs> Get out. Everything I do, I do it with a passion. <laughs> if I gotta be a bitch, I'm a bitch on the track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put up, put up when I'm. Gimme. This is my collection. This is mine. Put that too. My eyes are put. Okay, that's enough for one day. Um, Where did you put them? Because I was rubbing my eyes. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even have big, big boobs. Put it back. You don't even know what they smell like. Really? My eyes are really, really itchy. My eyes are so itchy shy. <laughs> Stop recording and come now and thank you. Up top. Shy. Thank you for doing this. Thank you. Shy! Come on.